Innovation Great innovation can give a company dramatic competitive advantage. This applies to all businesses, including those operating online. BlueNile.com has clearly demonstrated this advantage with its innovative online diamond and fine jewelry store. However, the company is not a household name. As their once innovative customer service model becomes a common practice online, will this booming company maintain its market lead? Blue Nile has a rapid success story. Four years after the company was founded in 1995, it was sold to Mark Fadden. Mark exponentially grew the company over the next five years and went public in 2004. After 10 years of operation, the company had more sales than Tiffany & Company. In 2012, the company had over 400 million in sales. Blue Nile has grown to become the largest online retailer of certified diamonds and fine jewelry. Blue Nile's vision is to offer high quality diamonds and fine jewelry at outstanding prices. Blue Nile's strategy is to create a recognizable brand name. This is done by creating high quality standards for its jewelry, providing comprehensive and educational guidance, having an unmatched diamond selection, and the commitment of superior customer service. Since the company started, there have been many, many imitators. Most of these followers can't seem to match Blue Nile's size of virtual inventory, its user-friendly interface, or award-winning customer service. The question is, can BlueNile.com continue to be the world's largest jewelry online retailer and remain profitable given its current competitive advantage with its current strategy?